A dying language isn't necessarily a dying language when the Aboriginal Teacher Education Program on Wapul Island steps afoot, rekindling the Ojibwe language. The Matukita Anishinaabemowin Let's Share Our Ojibwe Language Immersion Program was created in September 2010, affiliating with the University of Ottawa to produce proficient speakers and future teachers in the community. Instructor of the program, George Trudeau, said the course reintroduces the Ojibwe language to students who are willing to commit to learning the language and taking it seriously. Because I don't only teach language per se. With translations, I also teach culture, a, a cultural component within one word. Or to, just to have, a, uh, I give them a lecture, I give them a little story of any spiritual cultural component that they should know of or even to be aware of. So uh, learning an Islam is, you know, they should learn the language first before any, maybe they'll have a sense of understanding of our culture too. We cannot separate the two. Paige Riley, an ATEP student in her fourth year, feels learning Ojibwe has a deeper meaning when it comes to understanding the language. It's vitally important to our souls, to our body, to everything, because it's everything. It's the earth. It's okay, kiddo. It's where your words come from. It's what connects you with the land and with the spirits and the trees and the birds and it's how you communicate with them. It's everything. And that's why I think it's crucially important that we start speaking our languages that were given to us. <laughs> We have this gift that's given to us, which is our language, and then we have that gift to give to those kids and to everyone we meet. So a part of what is given to us in this classroom is my hope that we all share it, like it radiates out. Resource instructor and retired elementary school teacher of 33 years, Rita Sands, says you're never too old to learn, most especially your own language. Those that speak it um, feel it should keep on going and those that uh, want to truly feel Indian through and through uh, would like to learn it and should learn it and know it and use it. It means a lot. It was natural from birth and it was the, the way to converse and the way to, um, to now to uh, bring humor to speakers when they got together. And it, it's also um, a way to uh, figure out uh, route to uh, learners, to tell them um, uh, a way to, to learn these, these words and, and build on them. And um, I think that's important that, that they can feel that they can latch onto something and, go off uh, uh, learning from, from, from the root. Elders, teachers and students from Wapalaan still remain optimistic for the future as far as language revitalization comes. However, community involvement is the key to success. For Mediaplex News Now, I'm Alyssa Murphy.